We've been following the inspiring story of Tierney Gonzalez. Her heart is in a backpack, and she, along with her family at home and at Children's Hospital, her family there, too, are waiting for a transplant. While the wait is still on, there's cause for celebration. Okay, guys, you ready? I'm going to take, like, five of them. This family picture is a one-year celebration. For the last year, this team at Children's Hospital has been 20-year-old Tierney Gonzalez's family. She's now had her total artificial heart for a whole year. I really feel good. She had her hair and makeup done for the party thrown by her medical team. This is my home, second home, of course, but it's my home. I see Tierney every day, about every weekend. We have really become part of her family and she's become part of ours. Tierney is the first female to have a total artificial heart implanted at a pediatric hospital. This part of the total artificial heart accepts all the blood from the veins and pushes it to the lungs. And then this one accepts all the blood from the lungs now that it has oxygen and pushes it to the body. Inside her ever-present backpack is the medical device powering her artificial heart. Anytime you've seen a patient the sickest in their life um, to nearly having near-death experiences together to being the healthiest they've ever been to going home and to really reaching out to the community, it's impossible to not have a close bond. Together, her extended family is waiting on the perfect heart. What a great day. Well, one of Tierney and the nurse's favorite parts of the week are during her physical therapy when she plays Dance Dance Revolution, <laughs> which that? is really cool. <laughs> but I have to tell you, there were at least two times in, I don't know, the last few months that we were trying to interview Tierney and she'd had a relapse and mm -hmm. couldn't, couldn't do it. So it, it's a great day, but it's been a hard road. Well,